Hello, my name is Joy Pugh. I'm an assistant dean of students at the University of Virginia. I work in the office of the Dean of Students Residence Life, and I want to tell you that it gets better. Hi, I'm Joe Leonard. Um, I'm a first year here at the University of Virginia, and I'm here to tell you that it does get better. Hi, I'm Ed Warwick from the Office of the Dean of Students, where I'm the program coordinator for LGBT Student Services, and I'm here to tell you it gets better. Hi, my name is Cypress, and I'm a student at UVA, and I want to say that it gets better. Hello, um, my name is Katie Mayfield. I'm a third year student here at UVA, and I'm also one of the co-presidents of the Queer Student Union. Um, and I'm here to tell you it gets better. I'm Alan Groves, Dean of Students at the University of Virginia, and I'm here to tell you that it does get better. High school and middle school are pretty tough to deal with for pretty much everybody, but it's even harder if you're a member of the LGBT community or even just questioning. When I graduated from college, I took a job in a nonprofit agency. We worked with LGBT youth ages 13 to 23. I saw a lot during my time there from youth who were bullied in schools, had a hard time participating in church organizations or other local groups, all the way to the other end of the spectrum of youth getting kicked out of their homes because their parents either didn't approve of or um, had a hard time with their sexual orientation or their gender identity. In all of these cases and of all the LGBT people I've known, I've seen it get better. When I was growing up, I didn't know any gay people. It was something that my family didn't talk about. So by the time that I got a crush on a girl in the seventh grade, I had no idea that I could possibly be gay. I mean, you think that that's going to go on forever, but it's not. College is insane compared to high school and middle school, just with the amount of resources that they have for LGBT students, the awareness that faculty and staff and students have of the LGBT community. Um, UVA is a really accepting, embracing place for diversity of all kinds, sexuality and any other stripe of difference. And my experiences here have been really positive. I think one of the hardest parts about being gay as a young student is a lot of times you feel like you're alone. I think that college is a great place to be where you can develop a community with other people that are just like you that you wouldn't know are out there otherwise. I don't know, so if you're 16 or 17 and you're just and you're telling yourself that it will never get better, just, just think about this. You probably won't be at home forever. You can go out and you can make a life of your own. You can choose things. You don't have to be afraid of being who you are. At the University of Virginia, we have a very diverse and vibrant community of students, faculty, and staff living in a community that itself is very diverse, accepting, and tolerant of all types of people. One of the great things about coming to UVA is you're valued based upon your intellectual ability, the skills that you bring to the university community. And I think that that is something that you will find very affirming and refreshing when you come as a student at the University of Virginia. Now I'm not going to tell you that life is perfect, or that there won't be times that you'll be frustrated or see something that you think is fundamentally wrong. What I believe you will find at the University of Virginia is a community that's willing to stand up in support of you and to challenge people when they say things that are hurtful or harmful, ignorant or wrong. I've been able to find a community that loves and supports me, friends and family who care about me and support me for who I am and it's a wonderful thing. I, I've learned that it does get better. We all have the responsibility to help each other and make things get better. You have to talk to someone. If you're going through any kind of trouble, if you're being bullied, if you're being picked on, talk to the first person who will listen. Talk to a guidance counselor. Talk to a friend. Talk to a loved one. Talk to the person on the bus. Talk to me. It does get better. We all have the responsibility to make it get better. You'll move through life, you'll find those of us out there that support you, and even if you don't think we're there, we are, so hang on until you get to us. It will get better. It gets better!